common refrain you hear around the county, which is, how can we avoid becoming the next Atlanta? New tonight, Nashville's mayoral hopefuls are very much focused on how to solve the traffic problems caused by Music City's rapid growth. Box 17's Megan O'Halloran right now is live off of Trinity Lane with more on their plans. That's right, Scott. Well, take a look behind me. You can see there are plenty of people on the road tonight around 9.15 on a Friday. And in the coming years, we're going to be seeing even more traffic. According to the Metro Planning Organization, in 20 years, the Cumberland region will be bigger than the city of Denver with an estimated population of 2.6 million people. And planning for that growth and the need for mass transit needs to start right now. Nashville derailed the idea of the AMP, the city's bus rapid transit proposal to alleviate the heavy congestion on roadways and interstates. Even though the project is dead, the problem is not. These candidates running for mayor say tackling our transportation issues is a top priority. Right now, the way our bus system works, if you're right here and you want to get over here, you've got to go from here downtown to the to transfer. David Fox says he has a better idea. We'll need to have you know circulars that go around the city at various you know distances from the core. Bill Freeman is thinking more along the lines of something else. An above ground rail system uh, that would um, be a much faster uh, speed. And with our roadways right now, Linda Eskin Robrovic wants to look at more short term solutions relying on technology. Instead of driving around rather for 40 minutes looking for a parking spot, you're going to have an app that's going to tell you exactly where a parking spot is. Howard Gentry says we need to start doing the best we can with what we have now and then build on that. This problem is already here. It's not some future problem that's going to happen down the road. It is here, and uh, we've got to hit it head on. While these candidates may have a different approach on how to solve traffic problems, they can all agree on one thing. Something needs to be done now. A few candidates running for mayor were not available for an on-camera interview today, but they did email us a statement on how they plan to fix the traffic problem if they are elected. You can check out their responses on our website at fox17.com. Live off Trinity Lane tonight, Megan O'Halloran, Fox 17 News.